Hi, Jason Phillips from Auto Appraise, AutoAppraise.com. Late model inspection, 2012 Audi A5. Down at Suburban Auto Mall in Troy. Getting ready to take it for a test drive. Went around it with a digital paint meter, inspected it for uh, body repair, and found none. There's a few very, very small marks, a couple hairline scratches that could easily wheel out, a few small uh, stone chips on the leading edge of the hood, but uh, nothing to get super excited about. Car's very straight down both sides, no major door dings. Really didn't even see any minor door dings. Um, worst scratches on the vehicle are some entry luggage scratches on top of the bumper cover here. They may not show up in this video, but they're not horrific. Uh, all the options in the car appear to be working. 22,800 miles. A little bit of curb scuffing on two wheels. This is the worst one. Otherwise, the wheels are in very nice shape. It doesn't smell like it's been smoked in. leather seat bolster here is the that's the worst wear in the car and that could clean up a little bit actually it rained last night so there's a lot of rain dirt on the vehicle but it's a real nice vehicle didn't see any physical damage to speak of no paint damage all the lights go on and off appropriately as you start it up and we'll report more to you on the test drive Just hopped out on the road, getting ready to get into some Detroit traffic. Um, so far, all systems go. Very nice, quiet, tight vehicle. Haven't figured out how to work the nav and the radio, but checked out all the other obvious options. Everything seems to be working good. It's really low on gas, so I don't know how far we're going to get today, but that thing is right on the bottom of empty. Right on the bottom. Things so low on gas that there's a panic sign that comes up. Well, no, not really, but uh, really clean car inside and out. There's really no hand sweat wear on the on the leather uh, steering wheel wrap. Uh, no real arm sweat wear to speak of on the armrest. No um, seed pops or cigarette burns or you know what other kind of burns up there on the tops of the A pillar covers. Electronic parking brake feature is cool. Got to have your seatbelt on for it to work. Clutch feels good. It engages pretty much right off the floor. I'm going to catch that light. A little bit of front brake noise. It isn't really a pulse or a squeal, but I'm guessing the brakes are original on the car and you can just feel a little bit of roughness to the surface of the rotors. Nothing exaggerated, but probably it's going to be due for front brake service in the next 5,000 miles. Very nice vehicle. We'll hit a little more speed up here and wrap it up. six gears. Clutch engages about two and a half, three inches off the floor. I did a little driving in between pause in this video and uh, just really nothing to talk about. It drives great. Drives like a nearly brand new car should. No unusual noises. No bouncing going on. Jason Phillips from Auto Appraise finishing up kind of a boring inspection today on a pretty uh, pretty good looking 2012 Audi A5. 800-301-3886 if you need an inspection done. 300 guys on the ground nationwide. 
Thanks for looking. One more thing that rattle you hear in the back window is a license plate. If you're hearing that in the back background. Boy, this thing is fast. hairline scratches up here on top of the bumper surface. Paint meter readings 3.0 to 5.0 all the way around the car. There's a wrap up underneath the vehicle. That's about the only physical paint damage that we found. A little bit of curb stuff going on. The underbelly pan, no evidence of oil leaking through that. Front suspension still has all its original color markings, crayon daubs dots, etc. There's plastic closeout panels underneath these Audis and uh, there's no evidence that someone tried to jump the median. They're all free of uh, curb scuffs and rips and tears. Pinch welds still look real nice all along here. Uh, no real evidence of collision or hook marks. Sorry, sorry for the noise in the background. Suspension in the rear looks real good. Exhaust has a little bit of cosmetic decay, typical. Coming into the catalytic converter and then passing back through. No curbing damage there either. Paint daub still present on the coil springs. No evidence of a rear uh, seal leak on those half shafts. The transmission seal looks real nice. The split there in the case, if you can see that. No evidence of a fluid leak there. All the heat insulator pads are in place. No physical damage noted. Nothing to speak of. No major leaks, no obvious collision. Just those scuffs along the bottom of the cover. 800-301-3886 if you need an inspection. Thanks again for watching. Have a nice day. This looks like a pretty nice Audi.